Millions of people in the Northeast are now Sandy's victims without power, water, transportation, even their own homes. One Austin group knows what it's like to be in the middle of the disaster zone and what Sandy's victims are going through right now. Here's Shannon Wolfson. We're all working together to help business get back to normal. Some people might call Daniel Geraci an angel. There's over 8 million still without power. As he watches what's happening in the Northeast, there's just one thing on his mind. We, we want to deploy. Uh, so we want to help out. Three and a half years ago, this pastor founded the Austin Disaster Relief Network after his family took in two other families displaced by Hurricane Katrina. I was very involved in that and uh, just in a flash, I had this idea pop in my head. I believe it was from God. I need you to search upstairs for possible victims. Now the ADRN is 155 Central Texas churches strong. They've trained 3,000 people in disaster response. From the flooding in Williamson County to the fire that decimated so much of Central Texas. That is a monster tornado. To the fierce tornado that destroyed a third of the town of Joplin, Missouri. One third of the city was destroyed and one third of their people were walking around like zombies, uh, traumatized. Geraci knows what Sandy's victims need most, at least right now. A lot of emotional support right now. and. Uh, if they were a bit closer, we would be able to deploy about 400 people out there to help them. Right now, the ADRN doesn't plan to deploy to Sandy, but geography isn't stopping them from reaching into their pockets. Already, they're raising money for the victims. We will siphon those funds out to the most needed areas to those folks, and 100% of those funds will go towards you know the victims. Providing comfort and care for people he's never met. It's a time where uh, your, your world has been rocked. And, uh, and there's really one place to look in that time. Look close and you might see an angel. Well, ADRN is also working with the City of Austin Department of Homeland Security to provide disaster training for anyone who wants it in Austin. They've been doing that for about two years now, not only training volunteers, but also everyday people about how to prepare for a disaster. The next training is coming up next month in November. You can find details on the ADRN website, and you can find that link with this story at KXAN.com. Shannon Wolfson, KXAN News.